Optics OSN equipment, including Optics OSN 7500 to 7500, 3500, 1500, belongs to hybrid SMTP series products, which have a unified switching architecture and can function as a packet or TDM devices. Through collaboration, Optics OSN equipment is end-to-end -end used for access layer to backbone layer of a man. Optics OSN 7502 is mainly used on the backbone layer of a man. A single subrack supports a maximum of 320G packet capacity, 360G SDH higher order and 80G SDH lower order capacity. Optics OSN 7500 is mainly used on the backbone layer of a man. There are two types of Optics OSN 7500 subracks, namely common subrack and type 3 subrack, 2300 watts. The two types of subracks support different power boards, so their power consumptions are different. A single subrack supports a maximum of 160G packet capacity, 360G as the H higher order and 40G as the H lower order capacity. Optics OSN 3500 is mainly used on the aggregation and backbone layers of a man. There are three types of Optics OSN 3500 subracks, namely common subrack, enhanced subrack 1100 watt, and type 3 subrack 2300 watt. The three types of subracks support different power boards, so their power consumption are different. A single subrack supports a maximum of 160G packet capacity, 200G SDH higher order and 20G SDH lower order capacity. Optics OSN 1500 is mainly used on the access layer of a man. There are two models of Optics OSN 1500 products, namely Optics OSN 1500A and Optics OSN 1500B. A single subrack supports a maximum of 8G packet capacity, 60G as the H higher order and 20G as the H lower order capacity. Optics OSN equipment can be installed in ETSI and 19 inch cabinets. ETSI cabinets can be 300 millimeters or 600 millimeters in depth, while the 19 inch cabinet has been discontinued. Different OSN devices are installed in different cabinets. A DC power distribution unit, PDU, is installed in the top of a cabinet and supplies power to the equipment. Block A and Block B provide a backup for each other. Optics OSN equipment supports various types of PDUs. This table provides how each product supports PDUs. Optics OSN equipment uses an uninterrupted power modules UPM system to support the access of 110 volts or 220 volts power. The UPM power conversion system converts 110 volts or 220 volts AC power into minus 48 volts or
Leave slots is different before and after slot division. Slots can only be divided before delivery. Do not divide it personally. By function, the boards of Optics OSN equipment can be classified into cross-connect and system control boards, packet processing boards, packet interface boards, dual domain bridging boards, hybrid line boards, SDH boards, PDH boards, EOS boards, ATM boards, PCM boards, WDM boards, optical amplifier boards, and dispersion compensation boards, auxiliary boards, and power boards. Cross-Connect and System Control Board integrates Cross-Connect, System Control, and Clock Units to provide communication control, service scheduling, and clock processing functions. Packet Processing Board provides access of data packets and implements bandwidth management and a packet switching. PDH board encapsulates and maps incoming PDH services and cross-connects them to the SDH line for service transmission. EOS board encapsulates and maps incoming ETH services and cross-connects them to the SDH line for service transmission.
PCM board enables the SDH network with the access and scheduling capabilities of PCM services. WDM board.